donut morning. I had to film this first because Mal wants to eat it. Go ahead, get started. I don't mind. Uh, welcome to Saturday. We decided that we're gonna go up to Wilmington and go to the aquarium. And we started with Dunkin' Donuts. So we have six donuts. And then we got sandwiches. Mm -hmm. Half these are Double yours. sandwiches. And the other half. ones are theirs. Half. Uh -huh. Half are yours and the rest are ours. I don't think so. Do, Do the math. You had two. That means I had to have two. You have two. Yeah, that's I didn't half. get a sandwich though. That's a third. Yeah, well I did. I was hungry. Let's go to Wilmington. This is the dawning of the... Oh wait, I already made this joke. Aren't they cute? <laughs> you want one? Just jump in there with them. Yeah, no, they can cuddle with me too. I like this guy. This guy knows what's up. He's my new friend. Is he? What's his name? Herbert. Herbert. Hi, little buddy. He's a cute little buddy. He's gonna stick. There's so many. Oh, wow. They're so cute. My god, there's a lot of frogs. They're so cute. There's a snake sticking his head out of the, the back pillar. You see him? Stephen, come from over here and look at him. The snake is pooping. The snake is pooping? Yeah. He just stopped, but he was pooping. He made him be shy. He's got a shy Aww. colon. And and he's, he's just like me. See, he dropped some of it behind. Uh, but he, was, he had a big one coming out. Cool. He's so cool. Same as yours, oh, that's funny, Haley. Look at that tail. Oh, feet. Look at those cute little feet. They have a few other albino alligators at Alligator Adventure, so I've seen a few. I remember at one point there was like very, very few in the world. It was a crazy, crazy small number. Here's a copperhead. They're not fun. My dad brought a baby copperhead home one time in a little container. And I was like, that's a copperhead. And he's like, yeah, I know. And I'm like, that's dangerous. He's like, but it's just a baby. Well, and I'm like, no, he said, it, he said it? it free. You found a big one in the yard once too, didn't you? Oh, yeah, my dad's come across a lot of copperheads. He used to work for the city and he had to, he was the water meter reader. And uh, he came across them all the time and had to kill them because they were in the meter. And he had to like stick a shovel in there and kill them. Yep. They're gross. <laughs> the water's so clear it looks like the fish are flying. <laughs> Up there. But it doesn't really hurt. For sure. Oh, this cat. A hug. Who wants a hug? See, he's like slimy. Yeah, it's kind of weird. <laughs> it's like a dog. It's like, please pet me. <laughs> Hi, little guy. <laughs> You're in a crab. Look at your little tail. You know, seahorses wouldn't be half as cute if they were like six feet long. There's a big one over here. They would just be really scary. It's a little horsey. Maybe a sea king. That's kind of like a sea king. You mean a sea dra? No, sea king. Sea king is a fish. This one looks like You're thinking of sea dra. Oh my god, I'm failing my Pokemon. That poor man is trapped. I know trying to get out. I met a team of deaf rescue divers at the last deaf expo and because it worked well because they already talked with their hands anyway. So they all were rescue divers and pilots. So it was actually a really oh, neat group of people. Oh, there's another one. <gasps> what kind of fish is oh, that? It's like a beautiful ballet, but underwater and with sharks. It's the most dangerous ballet in the world. <laughs> <laughs> if you've ever wondered about hurricanes, here's a handy chart. Yeah. This is the scale because they go from one to five. As a general rule for people that live here, one and two, you stay here, and uh, three, you consider it, and then for four and five, you get out of Dodge, or you'll die. 
that's the rules. <laughs> the last time we were here, there was like either no divers or there weren't as many there or something. Any divers. There weren't any divers. Yeah, we must have come here at the wrong time. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like a mushroom cloud continuing to grow. <laughs> Is he trying to? They're trying to eat each other. I don't know. I think they're just hugging. Uh, maybe. But probably not. I think they're just hanging out. They're a couple of bros. Jellyfish have no heart, brain, or eyes. Yeah, people like you would say that. <laughs> people that read the sign above the exhibit? It's true. I read it on the sign. You do believe everything you read? In the aquarium, yes. <laughs> Take me home. I'll go home with you. Minnesota isn't that bad. Yeah. You'd keep me in a warm tank, right? Of course I would. You've seen the videos of like the octopus walking on land and stuff, right? It sounds depressing. It's really creepy. Really, yeah, really creepy. The they can yeah. like squeeze through incredibly small holes yeah, and then they start walking. But they're also doing yeah. oh, he's changing colors. Yeah. Oh, he was changing colors. He scary. was gonna. There's something about it he didn't like. Oh. Looks like he's trying. Maybe he's pooping. I change colors. I'm ready to move. It's like Mario 64. No, it looks like the Little Mermaid. I've never seen the Little Mermaid. How is that possible? I haven't seen you a lot. You live next to the ocean. I feel like you should. It's have seen well, it's that. it's kind of aimed towards young girls, and I was a young boy. One hundred and one hundred and one Dalmatians was my jam, though. Oh, I saw a Cruella de Vil car the other day. Really? Yeah, like the really sweet. Was old ride. was the person driving it dressed like Cruella de Vil? No, but she's probably the oh. same age. That's <laughs> less exciting. This seems like it should be a screen singer. I want to swim with them. I don't think you do. It might hurt. Doodoosh. You look delicious. I would eat you. Maybe. I don't know. You might not taste good. It moves. I don't like this thing. What is that thing? It's a clam or something. Oh, it's kind of disgusting like most of the other things in the ocean. You gonna touch it? I'll touch it. Let's touch it. It's like a smooth snake. What's it like? It's a smooth snake. Like there's no It's not like slimy. It's like a fish. They're bamboo did, sharks. Did it fill you with enjoyment? Yes. It's a shark. Yeah. It's a bamboo shark, Haley. Is a shark made of bamboo? You want to take one home? Yes? <laughs> That's what the stingrays are like. I see you found a friend. You excited? He's my best friend. You would take friend. him home if he wasn't a jillion dollars? I can't find a price on him. He's 14. That. What? 14 to 40. Is there any other tags? This guy got Because he was on this tag. Hmm. Let's check the check this guy. He Apparently he's priceless. Okay. He is to me. <laughs> Mouse going on a fossil hunt. Because she's a paleontologist. I love digging in the dirt with just, a, with just a hand and that's all. They're so loud and I can't see them. Where are they? Oh, I saw one. Turtle! They're so cute and alive. Nobody. Where have all the turtles gone? There's alligators in here. Are they? There's a sign. What, really? Are they snacking on the turtles? Here's the storm surge leading up to Hazel, which was by far the worst. But that was in 54. Never again. Or this year. That was it. What'd you think? Totally worth the eight bucks. I know, right? If you find yourself here in this area, you should come here. Seriously, because yeah. this Support is a local's aquarium. tip if you're visiting Myrtle Beach. Don't go to the Ripley's Aquarium. No. Go north an hour and spend $8 yeah. and you'll have a few hours at this aquarium. 
because if you go to Ripley's Aquarium, it costs like 20 something and you'll be there 30 minutes. The money that you'll save on your ticket is worth the gas money to come up here and go to this one. Yep. The more you know. Snookies for dinner and we're trying, what is this, tuna with ter teriyaki on it? This is an appetizer. It's new, I guess, or a special or s special or something. Well, dig in. Good? Mm -hmm. Pretty doggone good. That is a good looking piece of fish. And it tastes good too. Everything is so picture perfect. Bacon cheeseburger, crab cake sandwich, salmon BLT, and the coastal burger. This is the burger with the crab on it. I don't think I've been this hungry in a while. I'm really stinking hungry. I haven't been this hungry since yesterday. What has been making life difficult at the nudist colony? An unstoppable wave of fire ants. That thing that electrocutes your abs. <laughs> Nipple blades. <laughs> I can see how that could make life a little bit difficult. I'm gonna go with nipple blades. And that is the end of Cards Against Humanity, and I am fairly certain I lost! How many- I have six points! That's not good. How'd everyone else do? 19. 16. 15. 6. I'm playing with a bunch of women who don't get my humor, apparently. Anyway, um, that- th this is the end of the trip them. They gotta go to bed. And we gotta wake up early to go to the airport. They're very sad. But you had fun. Big time. Big time fun. Great. What was the best thing you did while you were here? Um, I got to see Alabama. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't here. Alabama. That had nothing to do with this. That um, was a complete accident. I, yeah. yeah. That was not on purpose. It was nice seeing your parents again because mm -hmm. they're like the sweetest people on the planet. I like eating unlimited crab legs and I like hanging out with you guys because I miss you because you left me. Well, you know, I never left you. You took her. Yeah, well, which makes it worse. No. Thief. No, no. Like a thief in the night. Yes. <laughs> yes. I came at night and didn't tell anyone. <laughs> And then everyone woke up and Mal was gone. Yep, yes. that's exactly what happened. That's absolutely that's correct. That's the story. Well, we'll be back at Christmas. And I'll see you guys at PAX. Yes, you will. Going to Seattle. It's my first time. So we'll see how it goes. This is my first convention ever. You're going to love it. There's going to be so many people, and you're not going to be able to see unless you're at the front. Mm. You know what? We'll hold you up. You could probably sit on your shoulders. Oh, could we become like... You know, like turning like a robot. Yeah, we need to think of a transformer name. <laughs> we need to both figure out like a cosplay that works together to be a giant transformer. I don't. I don't think I'm. I don't think I'm a cosplayer. I think I'm no. Well, you know what? But if we're giant robots, I will cosplay every day. Are you guys gonna sign off the vlog? Oh yeah, you can. In your respective, your respective languages. languages. <laughs> Your your native language of signing <laughs> and your native language of Spanish. Yes. Go for it. English is my second language. <laughs> let's let's meet back tomorrow, shall we? Okay. Do you know how to sign that? Oof. I know it's gonna be. Oh, I apologize goodness. because it's not gonna be exact. It's gonna be the words that I have in my vocabulary. It's gonna, it's gonna yeah. Be better than I would have done. It's be close enough. Same Z. Who's going first? We could go at the same time. Do it at the same and time. And you're not verbalizing it. It'll be like you're you're doing the Spanish. You are translating I and mean, you're interpreting <laughs> from Spanish to ASL. Yeah. You're okay. extraordinarily talented. Okay. Right. Go for it. Nos conocemos mañana, no? That was that was it looked like you knew what you were doing. <laughs> I don't know what mine would have been, but it would have been really terrible. I mean, let's meet back here <laughs> tomorrow, <laughs> shall we? That's oh, I signed it wrong. I signed it wrong. We gotta do it again. See, I didn't say date, luckily. Meet and date.
are very close and they catch me a lot. So apparently everybody thinks I date everybody. But really, I'm just meeting them. Nos conex nemos mañana, otra vez, no? <laughs> that was okay. My grammar is terrible, but I'm learning. So I'm gonna clean up this mess and then I'm gonna get some water and then I'm gonna have an ice cream cone. Because I like ice cream. The balloons are worth different amounts of points. A watermelon is one, orange is three, and uh, strawberry is. What's the, what's the Spanish no, the word for ten? I don't know. I, I know French. The ace! <laughs>